the key point here with this piece is that within each of us as individual humans we have this source of innate latent power and that it's not necessarily true that hard times create strong men but it's that hard times create the conditions that will sufficiently stimulate this latent source of power within to then create human beings that can themselves usher in better times. That's the point of this piece. The audio should be so much more supreme right now. Okay, so the next piece, the next piece, it is live. It's called The Human Spirit. Subtitle, Requires Hard Times. Ooh. So I think human history is <clears throat> fairly succinctly summed up with the quote, hard times create strong men, strong men create good times, good times create weak men, weak men create hard times, so on and so forth. I think, unfortunately or fortunately, depending on how you look at it, our current historical time is, maybe it's like the transition between Good times create weak men and weak men create hard times. I think we're closer to the weak men create hard times side than we are the good times create weak men. The weak men have been created and are now in positions of power. Whoa. So, but something unique about our times, our modern times, is that we now have the technological powers of gods and so we don't have the luxury of being able to play out this historical cyclical pattern because if we default to this pattern now, then because of the powers that we have available to us, we will spell catastrophic doom, if not like just complete end to the human species and many other species along with us, but to the human species because our technology is so powerful that it can do these things that we were previously incapable of doing like completely undermining the ecological substrate upon which we depend. But the key point here with this piece is that within each of us as individual humans, we have this source of innate latent power and that it's not necessarily true that hard times create strong men, but it's that hard times create the conditions that will sufficiently stimulate this latent source of power within to then create human beings that can themselves usher in better times. That's the point of this piece, a secondary point related and equally as important is that how do we prevent the good times from creating weak men and continuing this historical pattern that we no longer have the luxury to be able to continue. And although I don't go into <laughs> exactly how to do this, in the piece, some ideas are that we voluntarily subject our physiologies and our psychologies to hard times that are not forced upon us by external conditions, but we voluntarily impose upon ourselves because we understand that if we don't, then we will become weak and weak men create hard times. <laughs> That's the basic gist of it. I think it makes sense. I think I'm not going to say anything else because there's no need. Just read the piece if you really want to know. <laughs>